Hey everybody, what's going on? Frankie Love coming at you with your SmackDown for October 23rd. Now, right off the bat, I want to talk to you about um, the whole announce team. Now, you're going to notice for some reason that your normal SmackDown team isn't there. That's right. Uh, you see, uh, Michael Cole and The King are going to be announcing SmackDown this week. Why? Well, first off, I'd like to give your prayers out to uh, Jim Ross as he has suffered his third attack of uh, Bell's palsy, so and it's a r reason why he's not at SmackDown. And um, he may not be at bragging rights either. Uh, time will tell. He's seeing a neurologist over these next few days to see how bad and what can be done. Now, Todd Grisham, on the other hand, he's not at SmackDown because, well, he's on his honeymoon. Go figure. Somebody actually married that goofball. Anyway, let's move on. Your main event tonight on SmackDown, well, Friday on SmackDown, is going to be Batista and Rey Mysterio versus Kane and Chris Jericho. Okay, show's going to start off with Chris Jericho, of course. And he's going to be hopping bragging right. Then JTG comes in and interrupts him. Then Vicky Guerrero comes in and interrupts. Then Eric Escobar comes in. And then Dolph Ziggler comes in. And then Drew McIntyre comes in. And Kane comes in. Yeah, and they hold and Kane and Jericho run down the team. Oh, you're not ready, this, that, and the other thing. And you know, they're like, oh, you know, there's going to be a tag team match. It's going to be four on five. And you know why it's going to be four on five? Because Shed's not here. Why? Because he's sick. But see, here's the deal. If the SmackDown, well, the SmackDown bragging rights team loses, Kane and Jericho are going to replace the whole team. They're going to be like, you guys can't handle the truth. You guys can't get along together, guess what? Then you're not going to get along at all, because we're going to replace you. Well, I mean, they didn't say that, but that's basically what happened. So basically what happens is they're going to have a match, four on five. If anybody from the SmackDown team loses, Kane and Jericho are going to go... Kane and Jericho are going to replace the whole team. Then you have your first match, which is Eric Escobar, JTG, Drew McIntyre, and Dolph Ziggler, and they're going to take on the Hart Dynasty, Finley, Matt Hardy, and R-Truth. Went pretty long. Decent match. And then Matt Hardy hits a twist of fate after Finley hits JTG with the shillelagh. So guess what? Yep. Just days before a pay-per-view, they change a main event once again. So, as of right now, your main event for bragging rights, it's going to be Triple H. Well, let's rephrase this Team Raw, Triple H, Shawn Michaels, uh, The Big Show, Kofi Kingston, Jack Swagger, Cody Rhodes, and um, Mark Henry taking on the new SmackDown team of Chris Jericho, Kane, Matt Hardy, Finley, R Truth, David Hart Smith. And uh, Tyson Kidd. Okay, good. Then, uh, then we go on to Scott, uh, CM Punk, Scott Armstrong, and Teddy Long. They're in the back talking about the screw job. And uh, Armstrong bails out, but he runs into Vince McMahon. Uh huh. Yep. Uh, let's move on. Next match matches uh, John Morrison uh, defeating Mike Knox with Starship Pain. You know, after the match, he, do, yeah, he does a little promo. Uh, then later on, we see Jericho and Kane congratulating Hardy and company on replacing all five guys on the SmackDown team. Then, um, God, why, 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 why? Um, Mickey James and Michelle, Mc you see, yeah, I don't even know why I'm getting into this. Anyway, Mickey James, Michelle McCool, Mae Young, and Beth Phoenix do a promo, and Mae Young slaps uh, Michelle McCool. I mean, don't get me wrong, I enjoy that, but why you gotta get slapped by an 80, 90 year old woman is beyond me. But anyway, then we have Rey Mysterio and Batista talking backstage, blah, blah, blah. <sighs> Sorry. Anyway. Then we have Batista and Rey Mysterio against Curse Jericho and Kane. Talk about Pyro for this. Eh, 
Well, long story short, Batista pins Kane after a spear. And, um... It was pretty good, you know? Yeah, well, whatever, okay. And, uh... We have Vince McMahon talking up the, uh... Excuse me. SmackDown main event for tonight. You know, because the main event is, uh... Whatever the hell it is, uh... Punk versus Undertaker for the title, right? Yeah, okay. Talks about how Armstrong caved in. Uh, it, is there a foreshadowing of a Undertaker McMahon for WrestleMania 26? Eh, yeah, they kind of do a little foreshadowing with that. Um, Vince Black basically blackmails Armstrong by saying Bullet Bob could go into the Hall of Fame this year if he cooperates. Mm-hmm. Anyway, whatever. God almighty, why they do this stuff anyway. Eh, forget all this. Uh, Mickey James uh, wins with a spin kick when she pinned Layla. Um, they do the Captain Lou package. Then Cole and King, but uh, high bragging rights. And then CM Punk versus The Undertaker. In a submission match for the World Heavyweight title is your main event. Punk and company come out. New straight edge promo. You know, decent match. Undertaker basically wins with the hell gate hell's gates, the pipe punk, you know, attempting the uh screw job again. Well you know, act luck, it is what it is. That's what they did on SmackDown this week, it whatever. I'm I'm out of here. I gotta go to work. Bye.